Welcome to our Five on Five. We're pleased to welcome back Randy Samuelson, the Executive Director of the Hassel Center for Independent Living. Randy, how are you today? Great. Thank you, Craig. It's a pleasure to be here. Good. It's good to have you back. So tell us, in case anyone's uh, sitting at home and is not familiar with Hassel, what do you guys do there? Uh, we're what's known as the Center for Independent Living. There's seven of us strategically located throughout the state, and we help people with disabilities and seniors remain as independent as possible. And we do that through a various uh, means. Uh, typically when we get a, a f person with a disability, uh, they want to stay in their home. Everybody wants to stay in their home. And so we ultimately work on strategies to ha make that happen. The neat thing is it's the right thing to do. And in the course of this, we save the taxpayer, you and I, literally millions of dollars a year by keeping folks out of nursing homes and assisted living facilities whenever possible. Yeah, and so you're able to do this free of charge to the public. Now, Absolutely. who is eligible to, to get this free assistance? Uh, anyone. Uh, if we don't verify, if you come in and say you need a wheelchair, we'll loan it out to you at no charge for as long as you need it. Wow. Uh, walkers, canes, things like that. Uh, you can get your prescription from your doctor and it might take three, four, five months before you get the, uh, the equipment. And so in the interim, you can come to Hassel. And again, at no charge, we just loan it out to you and ask you to return it when you're done. And people are really great about bringing the equipment back. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. And one other thing you guys do is you help people find jobs. How do you help people in that yeah, That's we have a free, again, free, um, no charge. I'm not supposed to use the word free, but no <laughs> charge. Uh, so we work closely with uh, the Office of Vocational Rehabilitation Services, and so we'll get referrals from them. And then we have uh, Martin Williams as our job developer. He goes out to the community, talks to local businesses, and, and finds that perfect match. Uh, because I like to say that Having a disability doesn't mean you're disabled. You just might have to make a special accommodations. There's tax incentives. Uh, they can do an on-the-job training where the uh, VR, Voc Rehab, will pay part of the person's salary. Uh, and gradually, after three months, that, then they're going to know if that person is suitable. And hmm. typically, after a week, they'll know. And so we just try to, that is truly an empowerment. And that's what independent living is all about, empowerment, self-determination, choice, and independence. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we, we talked before about how you guys are located in Grants Pass, but you right. serve more than just Josephine County? Yeah, we serve Josephine and Jackson County, and on a limited basis, Coos and Curry counties on wow. the coast. But our primary focus is Jackson and Josephine County. So just because we're located in, in Joe County, in Grants Pass, um, don't let that uh, derail you. As if you need the equipment, if you need our services, we have a website where you can go and check it out and see, uh, you know, we have four core services and then we have a host of other uh, services that are for socialization, recreation, advocacy. Uh, we're, we're moving into youth in transition to help mm. folks with special needs, the young folks, uh, get ready to face uh, the economic realities of going to work. Yeah, okay. All right. Now, uh, I'm sure an organization like yourself always looking for volunteers, but you're also Absolutely. looking for some, some leadership. Is that right? Yes. Uh, we have a couple openings on our board, uh, so uh, I would encourage you to contact Hassel if you're a resident of Josephine and Jackson Counties and want to be involved with the organization that truly makes a difference in people's lives. Well, it's good to see you, Randy. Thanks yeah. so much for coming in and telling us about Thank it. Thank you. All right. Stay with us. We'll be right back.